Hi everyone, I'm Tripp, and today our guest yogurt, our guest food is going to be Yoplait protein. I don't know if I pronounced that right or not. I've never tried it before. And of course, I hope that you will subscribe, maybe like the video, and what else you need to do? I um, can't remember. Sometimes I forget to mention all this stuff. Oh, you ring the bell for notifications. Ring, ring, ring. Of future videos. Okay. Okay, the deal is... I don't really like healthy yogurts and creams so well. My favorite yogurt is Dannon. Dannon yogurt, yeah because it has the fruit in the bottom. I like any kind of yogurt that has the fruit in the bottom. But it's also, the, the one I like is pretty high in sugar. It's like 38 grams. And I have it every single year, just a few of them, just to make myself happy. Sounds like a commercial for Dan and supposed to be talking about Yoplait. So this is a very healthy yogurt. And the thing about it that's extra good is that it's protein. Well, my doctors and my family say that I need to have more, more protein in my diet because of my weight loss. I need to build, build these muscles. I put it in the, in the freezer just for five minutes so it'll be nice and cold. I think I like things better, things like this when they're, when they're colder. We're going to go ahead and open this up now. I hope it doesn't have any kind of weird type of, of opening mechanism. Yeah. yeah, open it this way. I guess I undo all these on the side. It's not quite as hot as it was outside, mercifully. It's been, for the last few days, it's been like 97, 98, 99. Today it's supposed to be like 94. And then it's going to cool off to maybe like the, the, the low 90s. Okay. Like I said, I'm not real fond of, of real creamy yogurts. They don't have a lot of sugar. That's why I like, I like things like the, the old Dannon yogurt that I used to get with all the delicious sugar in it. Well, the sugar's bad for you, right? So let's see how this is going to be. You don't shake it up or anything, you just eat it like this. In fact, you really can't see it too well. I'll show it to you like this. I'm going to have to put some out on the little plate. Like that. I'd rather keep it in, the, in its little container because it'll stay cooler. But you can't see that. So, it has a nice smell to it. Well, a yogurt smell. And here's a potential thumbnail. Don't want the light reflecting incorrectly. Fake, phony, social media smile that everyone uses. Hmm. I liked it better than I thought. But let's take a, let's dig a little bit more. Well. I have to say that I expected it to not like it at all. In fact, I kind of thought of it as just being like medicine. 
because it's healthy. It has a bunch of calcium. And I'll go over that in just a little bit. Even though it's not my delicious high sugar yogurt that I like, I might be able to have this and like it okay because it's low sugar, has a lot of calcium, and it has that protein. So I recommend that to everybody. And you can grow up and be big, as, big and strong, just like me. <laughs> yes, it's a birthday napkin. I'm using the other side. My wife didn't want me to use the birthday napkin. She said it was tacky. Well, I like to use everything up. I don't like a lot of clutter. Well, I'm very pleasantly surprised. It has such a, well, it's a, it's, it tastes like yogurt. Okay, let's um, do sort of a, a deep dive here. This has 15 grams. A protein in it. Now in the last month or so I've started taking like a little protein powder and I put it in fruit and things like that and I have a blender to make ice cream and I don't really like the taste of it too much the, the protein powder and I expected this to be like that too but it's um it's it's really good anyway and this particular one is key lime pie there are different flavors, flavor, flavored with other natural flavors. That's kind of redundant. A dairy snack, vitamin D added. This has a hundred, well here, take a look at it. Can you see that? It has a hundred calories, which is good for me, but maybe not for some of you. And it has a, it does only five, only only five percent of the daily requirements of saturated fat. That's one gram. I give it to you in grams. Cholesterol is fifteen grams, uh, fifty milligrams of sodium. Carbohydrates are uh, five grams. The total sugars are three grams, and zero added sugars. So the daily. So the daily dosage there is only is zero, zero sugars. Protein is 15 grams, which is 30% of your daily needs. And one thing I like over here is the calcium. 35%. I may have found a way to get more calcium in some kind of food that I really like okay. What else can we say? There's no artificial flavors, no colors from artificial sources, no high fructose corn syrup, excellent source of calcium, yeah, gluten-free. And this is manufactured in, where is it now, in Minnesota. So if it's from Minnesota, it's got to be good. That's a big dairy area up there. Keep it refrigerated. There's a date on it. It's supposed to use it by. Thank you for calling.
calling General Mills Consumer Care. For more than 150 years, we've made food with passion, having fun, and being true to our values along the way. Pour entendre le message suivant en français, appuyez sur le 9. What? What language was that? Hello, dear. My name is Rex. Thank you for calling General Mills. How can I help you today? Yes, hi. My name is Trip, and I have a, a YouTube channel, a Chatty Grandpa. <laughs> and I wanted to ask you a couple of questions, if it's okay to record you. Yes, sir. You are not live, you know, it's just a video. I'm just an old guy in a room, makes videos about food. But anyway, uh, first of all, how do you pronounce Yo Play? Is it Yo Play? It's Yo Play. Yo Play. What does it mean? Does it have a meaning to it? I'm sorry? Does it have a particular meaning to it? Or is it just a name of a, the family that started it, or what? It's just the name of the product. We don't have the specific uh, information with regards to that. Okay. Okay. Um, my question, I, I don't have any complaints about it. In fact, it's better than I thought it was going to be. Because I don't like a lot of creamy stuff, but I need to get more more uh, protein. And I thought it would have kind of a, a bad taste, but it's really pretty good. And I'm recommending this to anybody at all. I have a question about the... What was my question? That's right, the, the sugar. It says it has three grams, but then it has a uh, total added is zero, so... Zero percent. That's kind of confusing to me. Do you see what I'm talking about? And that's true on every every lot of different labels, not just this one. And one other question too. When I when I uh, called the recorded message, it was a different language than I than I'd heard. What would that other language be? It was a shorter. French. Uh, yeah, we also uh, we also a consumer department from the United States and Canada. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm used to hearing Spanish, but this time I heard something different. And um, je je comprends un peu de français, but not very good. <laughs> so I couldn't recognize it. Okay, I'll wait now for your research. Yes. Yes. So, uh, since it's a key line, um, there is like uh, the sugar added. Okay. Of, uh, I mean, sugar added for the key line uh, on some products, but this one doesn't have it. Okay, that's good enough. Okay, well, that's what we. I, I do like this yogurt, and this is the key lime, the key lime pie version. Anyway, hope you have a very good week. Uh, stay cool and peace out.